Okay, next. A door hoisting mechanism uses a cable system as shown below. Um, if the load W is equal to 3 tons, um, how much is the effort required at B? So, uh, hinahanap yung P na to. Okay, so to solve that, uh, basically may pagka-mechanics itong problem na to. So, una muna yung W, convert na natin sa, ano, sa pounds. So, uh, ang uh, note lang dito, no, na for every one ton, there is 2,000 pounds. Okay, so ibig sabihin, yung weight natin dito would be 3 tons multiplied by 2,000. That gives us 6,000. Okay? And then, uh, may tension dito, no? Tawagin natin ng tension AB, tension BC, ito rin yun. Ito naman yung tension CD. Okay? So, dito mag-joint lang tayo sa C. So, we have, um, this is the weight. Okay, this is the tension at BC. May binigay naman na slope. 3 horizontal, 1 vertical. So, this is square root of 10. And then, ito naman. Ang tension sa CD. Ang slope ay 1, 2. So, this is square root of 5. So, if you take summation of forces, um, Y is equal to 0. We have tension BC times 1 over square root of 10 plus tension CD times 2 over square root of 5, tapos minus 6,000. Transpose ko na sa kabila. Tawagin na natin yan na equation 1. Okay? Let's take summation of forces x is equal to 0. So we have tension BC times 3 over square root of 10. That is to the left, kaya negative. Tapos tension CD, which is to the right, will give us 1 over square root of 5. And that is all equal to zero. So using these two equations with two unknowns, we should be able to calculate for the tension at BC and CD. Pero kailangan ko lang talaga dyan BC. Kasi lilipat naman ako sa joint B, no? Okay, and that gives me, uh, ako, may mali, negative pala dapat ko, negative 3 over square root of 10. So I think that's it. No? So do you have 271, uh, 2710, no? 0. 0.52. Okay, pounds. Tapos yung CD, kahit hindi ko naman kailangan, sulat na lang din natin. So 5749.89. Okay, so next, punta tayo sa joint B. So sa joint B, we will have this three-body diagram. Ito yung P na hinahanap. Meron ditong tension from AB na ang slope ay 1 is to 1. So ibig sabihin, ito ay square root of 2. Tapos meron pa tayo ditong tension sa BC na nakompute na natin, no? 2710.52. Ang slope nito ay 3 horizontal, 1 vertical. Kasi ito ay square root of 10. Okay, so ganun ulit. Let's take, so I think ang, pina, ang unang magandang gawin dito, summation of forces X muna. Para masolve na kagad natin yung tension sa AB. So we have negative tension sa AB times 1 over square root of 2 plus yung tension sa BC times 3 over square root of 10 is equal to 0. So therefore, we can solve for the tension at A. So, 2710.52 times 3 over square root of 10. Tapos, pag ginang suppose, cross multiply mo lang yung square root of 2. So that's 3636.54. Next, uh, Let's calculate for P. So let's take summation of forces Y is equal to 0. We have yung tension sa AB na 
0.54 times 1 over square root of 2 upwards minus yung tension sa BC na downward. So 1 over square root of 10 and then downward din yung P all equal to 0. So from here, we should be able to calculate for P. Okay, so yung sagot natin, divide na na square root of 2 minus 2710.52 over square root of 10. And that's it. No? Kasi pag transpose mo yung negative P, magiging positive P na siya. Ah. Okay. So, 1714.28. Pounds. So, kaya kinonvert natin ahead of time no, na pounds kasi ang, ang required sa problem ay naka-pounds. So, anyway, close enough would be letter A. And that's our answer. Thank you.